All right, motivation, we all know that it comes and goes, and today I wanna tell you how you're gonna be able to self-motivate yourself, keep yourself going, and get the best results that you know that you deserve. So number one is that you have to be proactive with your motivation. So what does that mean? Is that you need to be someone that checks in with your coach. Don't wait, because a lot of times if you're working out, we don't know if you're going through something or if you need motivation. And the thing about Fit Club is that we're always here for you. I know I personally reach out to as many people as I possibly can. I know Jen and the team, they do the exact same thing. And as such, if you ever need a boost of motivation, confidence, or you just need to hear somebody say you're doing awesome, we got you. But be that person that reaches out to us. Number two, if you're really looking to challenge yourself on the blue and you're looking to build some muscle and go to heights that you've never been, then ask your coach for a spot. If you're going down to do the chest press, ask the coach if they can lift the weights up onto your thighs. I do it all the, all the time when I'm working out at the blue and we're looking to help you out. Remember that, that's our job. We're looking for things to do. And so if you need a spot, if you need heavier weights, whatever you need, be proactive with that and ask your coach to come and bring over the heavier weights or ask your coach to help you lift those heavier weights off the ground. The third thing is that I want you to challenge other members while you're working out. Today we did an AMRAMP workout and Coach Jessica goes to me, she goes, I got 10 rounds in that workout. So right away I announce it to everybody. It's like, hey guys, Jessica got 10 rounds. 10 rounds is what you need to meet or beat. And here comes lightning and here comes Neri. And all of a sudden, as soon as that buzzer went, all I see is just speed, speed. These two are going, they're going at the same rate. Boom, 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 they're pushing themselves. It was crazy. It was probably one of the best workouts that Nary's ever experienced. And lightning always goes 110%. But imagine that, if you can find that other member that you're just like, hey, today, you and me, we're going out. Or if you're working out across from each other, feel free to call somebody out. This way you're pushing yourself and then they're gonna push themselves to push you. The fourth thing I would tell you is that you need to change your mindset as soon as you get on the blue. When you get on the blue, we know what happens. You might have had a long day of work and you know you might have had a tough email that you had to deal with or a kid thing came up and you got plans after the gym or whatever it might be. We have all this stress. We have all these things in our head that's bogging us down. But as soon as you step on the blue and you start bouncing around, you gotta tell yourself, I got this. I'm gonna crush this. This is my time. Let's go, baby. Wake up. Call yourself whatever you need to say in order to get yourself motivated. But once you get on that blue, it's go time, baby. Maybe. And the last but not least is that you need to be that motivator. Be that second cheerleader to the coach. Be somebody that is encouraging, that's having fun, that's making the workout environment so much more awesome for everybody else. As soon as you start to smile, as soon as you start to think positive thoughts, not only do you uplift yourself, but you're uplifting other people. Now imagine you did this for the next five days. And then you take those next five days and you turn it into 21 days. You turn those three weeks into three months, the three months into a year, a year into three years. Imagine what your life's gonna be like. Imagine how good you're gonna feel. And when those days of when you lack motivation, just remember, be somebody that's proactive with their coach, reach out to them. Ask your coach to spot you or challenge you in a different way. Challenge other members to challenge with you so that you guys are pushing each other. Change your mindset. Instead of thinking you can't, know that you can and you will and you're gonna do it. And last but not least, be that cheerleader, be that super fun person that people look forward to in class. Now what I want you to do is I put a link in the description about more inspirational stories because our clients are real clients that have been there, done that. And by going into the inspirational stories that I put in the description, you're gonna find somebody that is in a similar situation as you, and just knowing that a real person was where you are right now, and they're thriving and they're growing, that gives you the outlook that it can happen, it will, because why? You got this.